<laughs> Welcome back, Saki Nation, to another episode of The Devil in Me. If you're enjoying the series, I need you to like, comment, and subscribe because if you don't subscribe, I'm about to say some very, very controversial shit right here. R. Kelly's going to piss on you. I'm sorry. He's in jail right now. I know he is. But he's going to escape just to pee on you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I really am. From the bottom of my heart, Big Papa is sorry. I am sorry. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry. But this is part six of the series. But let's get back into, into it. We Maybe left off right where we basically right where we left off at. That's probably just his theory because he can't reconcile a human doing this stuff. I think it's a mistake to say he's just crazy. He is in full control of what he's doing. He's just not wired like the rest of us. That's not crazy. Hmm. Crazy implies out of control. Look at this place. This is methodical. That's not crazy. No. Chicago police. Chicago police. Mr. Monday, this is Chicago police. Can you open the door, please? Mr. Monday, I'm Officer Stanley with Chicago Police Department. Can you hear me, sir? This is Monday. This is Officer Stanley. I, I need assistance at 8 West 50th Street, requesting immediate backup. I'm in Agent Monday's apartment. There's, there's blood everywhere and, and a body. I need immediate support. I think... Oh, shit. I mean, that's how he got caught. I mean, he called for backup already damn wait he's wearing the mask as part of the performance at best maybe he's insecure about something and it gives him confidence insecure like low self-esteem is he uncomfortable at parties does did his mommy not hug him enough he's been tracking us since we arrived mark was last seen in the basement Bad parenting can definitely be a factor, but it could be a shitty dad just as much, or an uncle, any adult figure, really. Suffocation room. What the fuck? Have you read any of our research? Mm, I just set up the lights. Take a look at this. What is that? The guy we saw murdered. It was a setup. There was no groundskeeper. But we saw a guy in a yellow jacket with her stuff. I guess that was Mr. Demet. I don't know. Something I'm sure seems he fits weird. the profile. Bullied as a kid, unchecked anger. As an adult, he's either an extreme overachiever or a cipher. Nothing between. Now, let's go all the way to the he top. He likes being in a position of power, especially over women. Okay, cool, but why? Lots of people put up with that stuff and don't turn into killers. Aside from the unhealthy obsession with H.H. H. Holmes, he's copying the M.O. Clearly, he identifies with Holmes somehow. This, is, this looks like over where he here. controls the walls and shit. Look at this. It's all his little tricks and moving walls and crap. Nothing in this shit box is real. He controls everything from here. It's a murder factory. You're right. We should use this against him. I want to find Mark. Not play Demet's game. If we trap him, we can look for Mark without looking over our shoulders the whole time. Okay, look. He's in here, right? So we get him to go down this hall and we trap him between these two moving walls there's no other way out of there he'd be stuck okay 
But how do you make sure he goes down that hall to begin with? One of us is going to have to be bait. God damn it. No, no way. It's too risky. Fuck that. No. Letting him run free. I'd say that's more dangerous. Come on. There's no second chances here. It's my plan. I'll be the bait. If you're sure, just... If it looks like it's going south, get the hell out of there. No argument here. I might need that. If he shows his face. Here, take it. If the it is his... for you, fuck his shit up. Get a get a hashtag please survive in the comment section. I think I think Kate will need it because obviously. So how do we get out? She's the hottest out of a model. But let me be honest, I think she needs it because this is his little lair. He's constantly in this room. Okay, be ready. You're fucking with us. Trap him and not me. All right. Here goes nothing. We ain't even get it explore at all. But that's all right. That's fine. <sighs> Come on, Jamie. Do not die. Head down the hall. Keep to the right. What? Did I miss something back here? Yeah, I missed a coin. See, it even tells you which numbers are what. So he knows. I think. Fucking bitch. I only got scared because of how ugly she More is. Being built. Hmm. Ah! God damn it. Holy shit. All right, here we go. Fuck, we can't even go in there. Oh my God, tell me why I thought- OH SHIT!
fuck that. Don't love. He's after our ass. Get up! Kate, hang on, please. Did we do it? Oh shit! Okay, uh, open it up! Open it up! Jamie, fucking run! God damn it! He's fucking toying with us. That doesn't look like Charlie. <gasps> no! What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Shit. What is it? A button. There's a reverse symbol on it. What, what, what does it? Shit, no! Damn it! We shouldn't have gave her that! God damn it! She probably would have been able to do something with it. If this thing, the wall will go the other way. Towards me? You mean? Yeah. This thing will kill me if I don't press it. Wait! I know! If I do press it, then you're the one that dies. God damn, do that! This is exactly what he wants. He's making you choose which one of us dies. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, fuck this. I'm not playing this game. I can't do this. I won't kill you. Nope. I really should have let Jamie? her keep her screwdriver. I'm I didn't think that'd it. come back to uh, haunt I'm not me. Not playing this game. Tell everyone I chose this key. And if you get the chance to fuck the met up, do it. Promise me. I promise. This is no. bullshit. I'm sorry, Jamie. Jamie. I need to look that up. If she would, if she would have survived. The button. She chose to spare Kate at the cost of her own life. Admirable. People can surprise you sometimes. Jamie chose not to save Erin when she could, leaving her to die, deprived of oxygen, suffocating to death. Meanwhile, Charlie has proved himself capable. Surviving the furnace and every other obstacle. Who would have thought it? Did the hint I gave you earlier help? Perhaps you'd like another. 
Yes. Have you read The Valley of Fear? The last of the Sherlock Holmes novels, and one of the best. Fuck no, I haven't. The temptation to form premature theories upon insufficient data is the bane of our profession. You should get back. I hope these chats are helpful. I certainly wouldn't want them to be intimidating. I'll be watching your progress. As always, watching very closely. God damn, man. I thought that fucking stupid. No, it wouldn't have mattered in that part if she had it or not. God damn. I'm sorry, Jamie. God damn it. Well, at least we have the screwdriver so we can fuck them up if we get the chance. So two are dead in our group. It's just Mark, Kate, and Charles. WWE! Oh shit. He fucking smashed our camera. Does this mean we're outside? Are we good? Holy shit, we're good. But we're not good. God damn it, here we go, here we go, here we go.
we fuck this up, we're dead. God damn it, stop! He's going to do them all? They really want us to fuck up. No! God damn it, no! Get up, Kate! Get up! Yeah! Stay away from me. God damn it, we're not in the best situation here. WWE! Yes! Get fucking shit on! Suck my fucking cock, you motherfucking bitch! He's gotta be dead! Who's the killer? I don't, you know what? I don't think he's dead. Rot in hell, asshole. Oh, God, I fucking knew it. God damn, he's really on to our ass. It's because we a baddie. God damn it again. Two more. Oh. My hands are fucking sweaty. three characters left no oh, this is a dead end this is supposed to be a way out I guess this maze was a cute garden feature once
Dead end there. Dead end. No, hold on. Fuck you. Fuck you. You know, if this is an actual horror g oh, never mind. You can't even hop that. There's fucking barbed wire. Of course. That we might need that. Yeah, there you go. <sighs> the fuck? What control box? Where was that at? Mm. Do we have to? God damn it.
Good morning, Chicago. We begin today with some breaking news. Chicago police today confirmed the body of a man found in a fire at an abandoned warehouse in the Fulton River District to be that of missing FBI agent Hector Monday. Monday has been identified as the shoeshine killer whose recent killing spree struck fear into the hearts of locals in and around Chicago. A spokesperson for Chicago PD confirmed Monday murdered four victims, including yesterday evening police officer Patrick Stanley, a dedicated veteran of 22 years. The fire was brought under control shortly before 5 a.m. this morning. The body recovered at the scene was burnt beyond recognition, but police identified Monday from dental records. Damn. Get the coin. Maybe home skillet curator can give us something good. And we're above 50 of them. I'm just looking for them little coins so I can get some help. <clears throat> Kurt Hall. What the fuck? I knew it! God damn it. No! He's just gonna bust that door down. Run! See what I say? He busted that shit down real fast. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry!
I thought those were spikes. Those sounded like sticks. <sighs> I want to at least make it through this episode with her alive. Please. Damn it. And him. I want all her characters survive to survive, but fuck, it never happens. The faster we kill them off, the faster this series ends, and I don't want it to end. With them all dead. Jesus. That's an actual fucking hand. But, there's the key. Why are the lights turning all on now? God, I don't like this. Oh God, what happened here? What's that? Why do you want to know, dude? Just sounds like an animatronic thing. Why do you stop looking at it? Why do you... Give it to me straight, Doc. God damn it. I don't like that. I don't like that one. We didn't get to explore down over here. Damn. That could have been bad. I was just about to say, when the hell we get to play as Charlie again? Fuck, when was the last time he had to, he had to, uh... 
put his life on the line now. It's your turn, Charlie. I don't want you to die, but damn, it's time for you to put it on the line now. <laughs> fucking Kate has been fucking fighting. Yeah, she still might die, because he's still on her ass. Look. Hey. Look. I could use that. How do I get to that? There's an area back. Oh, right there. I can make that. Okay, I see where we're putting it. Let's check over there. Oh, you don't get to. <clears throat> oh wait, no, Kate, Kate is good. She fell down, remember? Robert, yeah, I remember Robert. Don't let it get to us. Hello? Now climb back up. It's probably just an animal. But I know it's gonna scare the shit out of us. No? Okay. What? Okay, so we can't go that way. That's not a way. Dog. Oh, 
Shut oh. up! Yeah, fucking fetch. Probably death. I'm glad I went that way. What's the time? It's the only way. Waste of time. That could have been so much worse. Oh shit! What the fuck? Fuck! What the hell, Charlie? You're alive with broken ribs, Charlie. I, I thought you were dead. I nearly was. I'm sorry for that. I, I thought. How the hell did you make it out here? Yeah, good to see you too, mate. I nearly got fried, you know. I know. We saw it. You saw it? What the hell does that mean? How exactly did you get out of that? Where are the others? Mark, are they, are they safe? Aaron is dead. What? Dumek killed her. Oh, Jesus Christ. What have I got us into here? You tell me, Charlie. What have you gotten us into? We were all separated trying to get out. Dumet has the entire place rigged with traps. We fall right into his game. We have to get out of here. Get back to the ferry. Dumet disabled it. We all agreed we'd head for the lighthouse if we can't signal for help. I don't suppose there's any good news. Actually, <sighs> I never thought I'd say this again. Well, at least they're together. But fucking Kate's all alone. Jesus. All right, we're just going to end it there. Every we got 3 characters left. We started with 5. Aaron, Jamie, Mark, Kate, and Charles. Aaron's dead, Jamie's dead, leaving us with 3. Will they all survive? I sure hope so. But if Charles dies, hey, hey, I'm okay with that. But uh, let's try to let them all survive right now. I don't know how many, how how many or how longer this game is, but the more that they keep dying, the faster the game ends. But after this whole series is done. We're gonna get a compilation of all the 
big scares of me screaming. But thank you for tuning in. Big Papa's gotta go. Peace.